There's nothing quote-unquote professional NBA scouts hate more than a player who's both over 21 years of age and undersized in terms of height entering the draft. So when each of the 60 picks went by in 2023's draft and 5'8 Kansas State product Marquise Noel, who spent five years in college between two different programs, wasn't selected, despite setting the NCAA tournament record for single-game assists with 19 of them in the Sweet 16, the Toronto Raptors front office jumped on the chance to sign him to a two-way contract. Resembling prime Charlotte Bobcats Kemba Walker, a few months before dropping nearly 20 dimes in a single game, Marquise had a two-game stretch for the Wildcats in which he scored 59 points on 52% shooting from the field and also dropped 19 assists. Playing five college basketball seasons for Little Rock in his first three and Kansas State in his final two, this past year saw the 23-year-old average 17.6 points, 3.5 rebounds, 8.3 assists, and 2.6 steals per contest while shooting 38.6% from the field and 35.5% from distance. When all was said and done, he became 2023's Bob Cousy Award winner, which is given to the nation's top male point guard in Division I college basketball. In terms of his shooting release, it's easily transitioned into with pull-ups off the dribble from deep, and it's a form that heavily resembles Damian Lillard's. Noel has displayed the capacity to both put the team on his back individually by being able to utilize space-creating dribble combos which enable on-the-move jumpers that can even stretch out to the logo, as well as orchestrate an offense by setting up his teammates as a passing maestro. The quarterbacking from Marquise is all of ambiguous, gravity-luring, and in the flow. Passes which take serious skill, as well as muscle, to pull off. That muscle shows up in the form of passes that are either forced to have a high velocity behind them to be completed through traffic, or after embracing contact before setting up teammates by working his way into the lane. He may not be able to see over the top of the defense like a lengthy point forward, but his dime-dropping impulsiveness and basketball IQ stood out as creme de la creme. His 19-assist game of a lifetime to defeat Michigan State and help advance Kansas State into the Elite Eight was capped off by Noel, all of getting the game-winning dime, the game-winning steal, before taking it coast-to-coast -coast for a buzzer-beating lay-in. Despite the fact that he's heavily below the NBA or even the NCAA height average in the biggest moments down the stretch, Noel displayed he can craftily get downhill, shift his matchup with evasive pivots, and most importantly, knock down off-balanced attempts over much bigger defenders. With the way the New York Post was headlining him on their paper following his Sweet 16 Masterclass, you would have thought this man was about to go number one in the 2023 draft. Nevertheless, the newest Toronto Raptors journey to the NBA displays one of resiliency in terms of his heart being more pervasive than his height. Marquise transferred twice in high school, one change of school in which occurred right before his senior season, a 12th grade in which he'd average merely 10.9 points per game. This would, as you'd expect, garner him little to no interest from Division I programs, but he'd end up getting signed to the Little Rock Trojans in 2018-19. After three seasons in Arkansas, Noel would transfer to Kansas State for the 21-22 campaign, where in his second year with the Wildcats, he'd fuel the team into the Elite Eight, set the aforementioned tournament assist record, but also be selected to the first team All-Big 12 team. While Noel's going to be on a two-way contract and will likely move up and down from the G League throughout his first season, assuming he does get some time with the big club in Toronto, and he adds to an ever-evolving Raptors young core of talent centering around Scotty Barnes and Grady Dick. As I mentioned in my most recent breakdown of Toronto's 13th overall pick in Dick, the Raptors were desperate for shot creation entering the draft. Similarly to Grady, Marquise is another ball handler who can open up space for the array of combo forwards on this Toronto team. Given the Raptors, assuming they let Van Vliet walk, really don't have a player that matches Noel's skill set, that's why despite the fact that he's on a two-way contract, you could see him in the NBA sooner rather than later. Regardless, based off what you just heard, 
Noel's journey to where he's gotten today has been pretty unbelievable, making the incoming adversity he'll face in the association second nature. Based off both that journey and his bulldog-like skill set for his undersized frame, I'm excited to watch the 23-year-old's journey as a raptor. Just 14.6% of you watching are subscribed, so please subscribe. This was Flow, and see you next video.